A warm welcome to you. I am Karen Smith, and I love inspiring children to create treasured objects that are crafted with a needle and thread. In addition to my main lesson teaching for kindergarten students, I am also Lotus and Ivy's hand sewing compliment teacher for six year olds and students in classes one and two. And I'm delighted to spend time outside my main lesson classes to cultivate the practical and meaningful hand skill of sewing with my students. Teaching children to make useful and beautiful things with their hands is a unifying thread within Waldorf education. Throughout my years as a Waldorf teacher, hand sewing has been part of my kindergarten curriculum. And the work the students do in my hand sewing compliments is much like what my in-person students created in my classes before I switched to online teaching. Because our time for such focused intensive projects is short during the main lesson, hand sewing compliment classes extend your child's opportunity to develop strength and refine coordination in their fingers and hands. All children benefit from practicing sewing skills. Did you realize that the muscles in the hand that are needed to thread a needle or to hold a needle as it's being used for stitching are the same muscles that are needed to correctly hold a pencil? Improving fine motor skills prepare students for writing, drawing, and the artistic work that they'll experience in the grade school. Additionally, the attention to detail necessary for sewing reinforces eye tracking, eye hand coordination, and spatial awareness. It's incredible what a needle and a little bit of thread can do. Handwork activities engage both sides of your child's brain. The left side of the brain helps the child work through the technical problem solving aspects of sewing, such as the distance between their stitches and how to make a stitch knot. In contrast, the right side of the brain fosters creativity and imagination as the child chooses colors, designs, and embellishments for their project. And that allows them to express their own unique personality and creativity. The practical, repetitive nature of hand sewing offers your child an inwardly calming experience, similar to mindfulness or meditation. Because your child concentrates so much, they become fully engrossed and absorbed in the pleasurable activity of repeatedly pulling a thread through felt. You can think of this repetition as the state of flow, which often settles a busy child who struggles to sit still. By regularly engaging in sewing and other meditative crafting activities, children can strengthen their ability to stay calm or bounce back more quickly when they are feeling stressed. Through stitching and creating their own beautiful projects, children gain confidence in their ability and they learn essential life skills, such as problem solving, following process directions, patience, and perseverance. As with any new skill, the more the child practices stitching, the easier sewing becomes. Especially in this immediate gratification time in which we live, patience, focused concentration, and stick to are harder to instill in our children. These skills are developed with projects that take days or weeks to complete, allowing your child to practice and improve their techniques through focused attention to detail. By now, you are likely wondering how a hands-on skill like sewing can be taught successfully through online live classes. Well, let me show you some of the fantastic photos that parents have taken of their children during my hand sewing classes for kindergarten and first and second grade students. My compliment classes rely on adults as my long distance hands. So plan to be by your child's side at every class for assistance with knots and challenges that a child who's new to stitching might encounter. Class one and two students will meet once a week for hand sewing each spring semester for the entire semester. 
And in the spring semester, also, my capable six-year-old students can enroll in my hand sewing session that meets twice a week for nine weeks. And once that session is complete, we'll have kindergarten woodworking twice a week for nine weeks. It's incredible to witness the transformation as students go from struggling beginners to confident stitchers. The joy and the sense of accomplishment when each sewing project is completed is genuinely heartwarming. Students emerged from my experiential classes with a sense of self-reliance, accomplishment, self-esteem, and great pride in their ability to construct treasured playthings with their own two hands from simple natural materials. The foundational sewing skills and techniques the students learn build from one project to the next. A child's patience and perseverance to work through repetitive steps and unexpected challenges increases. By the end of each session, your child will be able to approach future hand sewing projects of their own creation with confidence, enthusiasm, improved craftsmanship, and capability. Your child will have developed a maker mindset that can carry them through life. Learning to stitch by hand will be helpful throughout your child's life. Apart from making original hand sewn gifts for those they love, your child will have the, the skills to extend the life of objects by replacing a button, mending a ripped seam on a well loved stuffy, or repairing a hole in the knee of a pair of pants. I've even had a student who took the initiative to repair the cushion on his family's couch. Instead of throwing an item away, your child can confidently fix it and continue using it. This gesture instills a sense of value and concern for the environment in our world of easily discarded things. Hand sewing also promotes a sense of reverence for the craftsmanship and instills respect for the makers of the world and the treasures that they create. Hand sewing is a skill that all children enjoy. I invite you to connect with me if you have additional questions about our program, and I look forward to having your child in one of my compliment classes in the future. Have a lovely day.